Hi, welcome back. So long before I started to take nicotinamide mononucleotide as a daily supplement, I did a fair bit of research. I, I read some papers, I read some blogs, and I watched hours and hours of YouTube videos. And it became very apparent very quickly that the majority of people were saying much the same thing, just in a slightly different way. Uh, this prompted me to write a list of pros and a list of cons. It then occurred to me that people who haven't actually started their NMN journey yet and are still doing their own research may benefit from getting a, con a condensed version of the information that I've gleaned so far. So I've made a small PowerPoint presentation that we'll jump into in just a second and I'm going to cover the first four main reasons that I think it's beneficial to take NMN as a supplement to raise our NAD levels. NAD, or nicotinamide adenine dinucleotide, to give its full name, is found in virtually all of our living cells. NAD is essential for sustaining life. NAD levels decline drastically with age, creating an energy deficit that decreases our body's ability to retain youthful functions. NAD is biologically unstable, which makes it unsuitable for oral supplementation. Fortunately, it's easy to restore your cellular NAD levels using NMN or NR, nicotinamide riboside. These convert to NAD once they are in the cell. To give you an idea of how our NAD declines with age, by the age of 50, a typical person may have less than half of the NAD that they did in their youth. And by the age of 80, these levels may have dropped to between 1 and 10% of those levels expressed in our youth. A fascinating aspect of NAD is its dual role in protecting against factors that age us. This includes mitigating chemical stress, inflammation, DNA damage, and failing mitochondria. All these conditions are associated with aging. In other words, while a decline in NAD levels may negatively influence lifespan, so restoring NAD is increasingly being viewed as a cutting-edge tool to promote longevity and a way to combat the diseases of aging also. A rigorous scientific review reveals that longevity benefits arise from numerous but different interrelated functions. I will now summarize the first four anti-aging mechanisms affected by NAD. So, why increase our NAD levels? Well, firstly, it's to restore cellular energy. NAD is required for proper cellular energy utilization. Our NAD levels decline drastically with age. This is, creates an energy deficit and decreases our body's ability to retain youthful function. As we know, NAD is unstable and it cannot be used as a supplement, but NMN as a precursor to NAD is capable of restoring cellular NAD levels. Studies in animals have shown that NAD supplementation can slow cellular aging and improve many of the metabolic defects common with the aging process, including obesity, diabetes, and cardiovascular diseases. NAD may contribute to longer telomeres. Telomeres are stretches of repetitive DNA strands that cap the ends of our chromosomes. Like the burning of a fuse, telomeres at the ends of our chromosomes steadily shorten every time a cell replicates itself. Once telomeres reach a critically short length, cell renewal virtually stops, leading to accelerated aging or death of the cell. Telomere shortening is both a marker of cellular aging and a predictor of a shortened lifespan. NAD is required for 
functioning of the sirtuin proteins. These contribute to longevity and specifically to maintaining the length of critical telomeres. Certain other nutrients, such as resveratrol, may activate sirtuins and contribute to extending lifespan. But emerging evidence suggests sirtuins best function with an ample supply of NAD. Taking NMN as a supplement is not the magic bullet for longevity. To date, exercise and weight loss have been shown reliably to effectively lengthen our telomeres. DNA repair. NAD promotes DNA repair. Even though our DNA is protected by its chromosomal shelter, it is still highly vulnerable to damage. This DNA can lead to broken DNA strands and mutations in critical genes. Accumulated DNA damage contributes to the aging process and can result in specific lifespan shortening diseases such as cancer and poor immune function. When DNA is damaged, it activates an enzyme known as PARP1. PARP1 carries out DNA repair within our cells. To carry out this function, PARP1 consumes enormous amounts of NAD. As NAD is depleted, the ability of PARP1 to repair our DNA is significantly hindered. Improving DNA repair with NAD may slow cellular aging, reduce the persistence of cancer-causing mutations, and play an important role in pre preventing inflammatory conditions. So let's look at immune cell signaling. NAD modulates immune cell signaling. As we age, our immune cells begin to lose their focus. Some become overactive and this contribute, contributes to autoimmune diseases. Others slow down, which increases the risk of infection. The process, which is called immune senescence, is intimately related to my mitochondrial function and energy balance, both of which depend on NAD activity. NAD induces energy intensive enzymes. A universal feature of aging is the loss of cellular energy. This results in diminished ATP levels and inadequate cellular fuel. This fuel is necessary for us to power our bodies. One cause of this energy loss is a breakdown in the efficiency of the electron transport chain. This main pathway is used to extract energy from our food. Disorders ranging from obesity to diabetes to bone loss have been associated with the loss of this vital pathway. Studies now show that restoring this transport chain by raising NAD levels is a rapid an effective way of promoting the essential enzymes involved in energy extraction and sustaining youthful cell function. This provides protection from age-related diseases. NAD enhances our core cellular anti-aging mechanisms. When these functions are impaired, the consequence is accelerated aging. This contributes to disorders as diverse as Alzheimer's and osteoporosis. Restoring cell NAD levels has been shown to preserve youthful function and even reverse some age-induced deterioration. Supplementation with NMN has been shown to slow cellular aging in mice and improve many metabolic defects common to the aging process, including muscle wastage, insulin resistance and inflammation. OK, so I hope that was beneficial uh, and it's given you some more information um, or it's cleared up something that may be confusing with regard to taking nicotinamide mononucleotide as a daily supplement for increasing your NAD. Uh, I'm going to do a three part series to this. I'm going to do another four reasons uh, equally as important as the first four for taking NMN to raise your NAD. Uh, and the third one, I think to balance it out, I'm going to do a smaller um, video on possibly the reasons to think twice or to think longer and harder about taking NMN 
as a daily supplement um, at the moment in, in 2019. So thanks for watching. See you soon. Bye.